Good morning and welcome to the 55th Sam Steel Society induction ceremony at New Mexico State University at the College of Agricultural, Consumer and Environmental Sciences. I'm Rolando Flores, Dean and Chief Administrative Officer, and I am privileged to represent the students, faculty, and staff of the College of ACES. We are here to honor the spring 2021 graduating class of seniors, masters, and doctoral students from the College of ACES. With more than a year of virtual celebrations, we are excited to be celebrating our students in person once again to this drive through system. The Sam Steel Society was formed in 1992 to bond our college family more closely. I hope all of you will agree with me that the sense of family is strong in the College of Aces. The Sam Steel Ceremony honors each graduating class from the college in anticipating anticipation of the contributions they will make to society. It also recognizes family members who have supported them in their journey and throughout their, our college. With that being said, I would like to recognize everyone that makes today's event possible. Thank you, Hector Gonzalez, for providing audio and visual, Tommy Lee Turner and Arturo Rubiola for video production, and Marcus Kahn and the ACES IT department for coordinating internet. A special thanks to Shelby Herrera, Ashley Lama Mendoza, and Jamie Wagoner for coordinating this event, and the college ambassadors for assisting with the ceremony this morning. This has been a very trying year, but the moment that we are celebrating now with this graduation shows the fiber of our students and the fiber of the college. So we are extremely proud of having this event and extremely proud for all the learnings that we have during the last year. With no further ado, please join Associate Dean Donna Connor and myself in congratulating our graduating class. I want to introduce Assistant Dean and Director of Business and Resource Planning, Tim Nesbitt, and the Associate Deans for Research, Leslie Edgar and the Associate Dean for Extension, John. Don? Thank you. We go here. First one. Okay. Our first graduate this morning, Tania Medina Chavez. Tania's future plans are finding a job in her field. 
Tania's greatest accomplishment while attending college was being able to pursue her career while raising her children and family. Tania would like to thank her husband for fully supporting and understanding and her parents and sisters who were there to help out and always supporting to achieve her goals and to get her diploma. Congratulations, Tania. Our next graduate, Nadia Justiano. Nadia's future plans include to work back home in Bolivia with her dad, who is an animal scientist, and continue working on the family farm. Nadia's greatest accomplishments include being a student athlete, NSLS induction in 2021, being a Crimson Scholar in 2018, 2019, being a TA for Animal Science 100, and receiving academic scholarships. Nadia would like to thank all of her friends and family members that helped her get through college and to all the professors at the Animal Science Department that took the extra step and time with her. Congratulations, Nadia. Our next graduate is Jose Solis. Jose's plans are to find a great job working with families. Jose's greatest accomplishment was to adjust to the age difference while Complete, completing his bachelor's degree. Jose would love to thank his family and friends for their support, especially his wife, Celine, and his parents. Congratulations, Jose. That's going good. Yeah. Our next graduate, Megan Gorman. Upon graduation, Megan will be accepting a sales coordinator position at the Courtyard by Marriott Las Cruces Hotel. Megan's greatest accomplishments while here at NMSU include making the Dean's List several times, being a Crimson Scholar every semester, and making the Honors List. Megan would like to thank her family and friends that have helped her throughout these last four years of her life to make it here today. Congratulations, Megan. Our next graduate, Jason Quintana. Jason's future plans are to work in Wetachee, Washington for the Farm Service Agency with the United States Department of Agriculture. Jason's greatest accomplishments include being elected into ASNMSU as a senator for the College of ACES and being the president of Alpha Gamma Rho and of the Agriculture Economics Club. Jason is receiving the Outstanding Student Award. Jason would like to thank his grandparents Ronald and Nellie Quintana for all of their financial and emotional contributions. Without you guys, he wouldn't be here today as well as all the faculty. Congratulations, Jason. Our next graduate, Jennifer Van Auken. Jennifer's future plans are to start her job with U.S. Forest Service as a range technician. Jennifer's greatest accomplishments while attending college was all of the experience she was able to get doing different studies and professors and grad students. Jennifer would like to thank her professor, Dr. Ganguly, for helping and supporting her through college, as well as her husband, Corey. Congratulations, Jennifer. <laughs> Backing in. Yeah. Our next graduate. Backing into his spot, D Dylan Martinez. Dylan plans to move back home to enjoy some time with family and friends enjoying the great outdoors and looking to continue his search for a job in economics and policy analytics. Dylan's greatest accomplishments include finishing top eight at the Southern Ag Econ Conference, getting accepted to the Western Ag Econ Conference, and maintaining the role as Pistol Pete throughout his school experience. Dylan is receiving the Dean's Award of Leadership Excellence. Dylan would like to thank his dad, Jim, mom, Kimberly, girlfriend, Nika, close family and all his caring friends and professors that helped with papers, Taco Tuesdays, and afternoon conference calls. Congratulations, Dylan. Our next graduate, Michaelin Wilkinson. Michaelin's future plans include completing her master's and working in extension. Michaelin's greatest accomplishment was completing organic chemistry on the first try. Michaela would like to thank her family and friends as well as the EPWS office for being so welcoming and able to answer questions. Congratulations. Our 
Our next graduate, Akram Banali. Akram's future plans include getting a job. Akram's greatest accomplishment is a PhD in plant and environmental sciences. Akram would like to thank his advisor, Dr. Manoj Shukla, the, department of, the departmental office, and everyone who believed in him. Congratulations, Akram. Our next graduate, Chalice Evans. Chalice would be exploring, will be exploring graduate schools and job opportunities. Her career field is broad and so are her options. Chalice's greatest accomplishments include student teaching both online and in person as well as being SRA of Rhodes Garrett Hamill. Chalice would, is receiving the Dean's Award of Excellence. Chalice would like to thank her parents, the village that raised and supported her, her friends for watering her growth, and Karina Arvizu for dealing with her. Congratulations, Chalice. Ana Garcia Escalante. Ana will move to Columbus, Ohio, where she will start her PhD program in consumer science with an emphasis in hospitality. Anna plans to one day become an excellent professor just like the ones here at NMSU. Anna's greatest accomplishments include attending different international conferences that created a valuable impact in her life. Also being able to reach her goals and continue her work for new ones. Anna would like to thank her family. Without their support, nothing would have been possible. Her friends for always believing in her, her professors and mentors for sharing their knowledge and passion. Congratulations, Anna. Wyatt Sandoval. Wyatt's future plans include pursuing a career in marketing or, and or professional base bass fishing. Wyatt's greatest accomplishments at NMSU were representing the college at the highest level in collegiate bass fishing and being on a, the team that placed second internationally at NAMA. Wyatt would li like to give a big thanks to his parents as well as the friends he has made here at NMSU for always helping him in times of need and offering new perspectives. Congratulations, Wyatt. Nancy Lacano. Nancy's future plans are to continue with her master's program through NMSU, take a semester off and start fresh by spring of 2022. Nancy, Nancy's greatest accomplishments include being a first generation in her family to finish college, and she feels proud of that and she was a Crimson Scholar for every semester she attended NMSU. Nancy would like to thank her family and friends that were there for her during this career. To all her mentors that took time to help her, but especially to God for the opportunity to finish her dream. Congratulations, Nancy. Mackenzie Frizzell. Mackenzie's future plans include transferring to Sol Ross State University to complete her Master's of Business Administration. After she, after, she plans to pursue a career in event production and real estate. McKenzie's greatest accomplishments include holding the position of Regional Student Director of the National Intercollegiate Rodeo Association and being an active member with the rodeo program. McKenzie would like to thank her family and coaches for always supporting her and pushing her to do her best. Because of them, there is no goal that cannot be accomplished. Congratulations, McKenzie. Stacy Swoop, Stacy's plans to work in her family's flower shop in Deming. She hopes to use what she has learned about communications and marketing to help the business move into the future. Stacy's greatest accomplishments throughout college are representing NMSU at the National FYFNR Discussion Meet Contest and the National AIFD Floral Symposium Competition. Stacy would like to thank all of the professors and, and NMSU staff that helped her along her journey. She would also like to give a big thank you for her wonderful family for always loving and supporting her. Congratulations, Stacy. Becky Miller. Becky Sue's future plans include working to pay off her undergraduate loans and then pursuing a graduate degree in cell biology. Becky Sue's greatest accomplishments include surviving calculus, and organic chemistry, also finishing her degree during this pandemic time. Becky Sue would like to thank her two cats, 
her mom and her beautiful girlfriend for their constant support and providing snacks on the roughest days. Congratulations, Becky. Logan Boone. Logan's future plans include volunteering for the Peace Corps in the agricultural position, where upon completion, she hopes to continue her education by going to graduate school here or in Canada. Logan's greatest accomplishments include becoming an, AS, an ACES ambassador and mentor and being involved in several clubs on campus. All of this was done whilst also obtaining a second degree in sociology. Logan would like to thank her professors, especially those in EPPWS department. They truly helped her survive college. She would also like to thank her mom, without whom she wouldn't even be here. Congratulations, Logan. Adam Hopper. Adam's future plans include going to the University of Maryland, College Park, to pursue his PhD in plant sciences. The research he's interested in is food safety and crop quality. Adam's greatest accomplishments include serving the students of the ACES College as an ASNMSU senator and being a part of the HHMI research program, which helped him find a passion in research. Adam is receiving the Outstanding Student Award. Adam would like to thank his family and close friends for being the biggest support system. He would also like to thank the horticulture faculty for being a crucial part in his success at NMSU. Taylor Edwinson. Taylor plans to go to vet school. Taylor's greatest accomplishments include, include being involved in extracurricular activities and meeting great people. Taylor would like to thank her friends, family, and some amazing professors. Congratulations, Taylor. Race Wagley. Race's future plans are to move back to Animus and begin working on his family's farm. Race's greatest accomplishments include being on the Dean's List as well as being a Crimson Scholar. Race would like to thank his fiance Tiana, his family, and his many friends for helping and supporting him through his college adventure. Congratulations, Race. Kendra Warden. Kendra will be returning to her home state of Arizona where she will be working for Maricopa County Animal Care and Control, conducting behavior, behavior evaluations and modification for shelter animals. Kendra's greatest accomplishments include representing the ACES College in India at the Women's Economic Forum and working in a lab for two years in order to complete an honors capstone thesis. Kendra would like to thank her parents for their endless support fellow RAs for making work school balance a little easier, and her Sigma Alpha sisters for the love, laughs, and tears they've shared. Congratulations, Kendra. Gustavo Sanchez. Gustavo's plans, plan is to find a career that will help improve the quality of the environment we share with the plants, animals, and water. Gustavo's greatest accomplishments is actually graduating. It wasn't easy. Gustavo would like to say thank you to his family and parents, in particular his father who passed away from cancer last year. Also, and to all the professors and students that helped him along the way. Congratulations, Gustavo. Jaden West. Jaden will be accepting a promotion in his current company, TMS, to a front office manager's position in Albuquerque at Fairfield. Jaden's greatest accomplishments have been a part of the Crimson Scholar Program, Outdoor Leadership Program, the HRTM Department, and the music programs he had, has been privileged to be a part of. Jaden is receiving the Outstanding Student Award. Jaden would like to thank his parents, Janelle and Brian, his sisters, his grandparents, aunt and uncle, his second mom, Lisa, and his best friend, McKaylee, Jamie, and Isa that have helped him on this journey. Congratulations, Jaden. Tana Lowe. Tana intends to pursue a career in extension or agriculture-based journalism. Throughout college, Tana served as an ACES ambassador and helped jobs and held jobs while attending classes full-time. She also served as a board member for the Southwest Quarter Horse Association. Tana is receiving the Dean's Award of Excellence in the graduate, as a graduate. Tana would like to thank her advisor, Dr. Shannon Norris, for her endless support and motivation, her parents for their love and support, and her friends and family for keeping spirits high. Congratulations, Tana. Marel Lopez. Marel's future plans include going to graduate school to supply 
her to study bioinformatics and setting up her own clinical lab. Marielle's greatest accomplishments include graduating top of her class from the biology department, being awarded with the gold cord from Arts and Science College, and graduating as a Crimson Scholar. Marielle would like to thank her mom for supporting her journey and for her encouragement every step of the way. Congratulations, Marielle. Daisy Valenzuela Maldonado. Daisy's future plans are to attend graduate school and continue to build her experience working with children and their families. Daisy would like to thank her parents as well as her husband for all the sacrifices made to help her attend school and for always motivating her during challenging times. Congratulations, Daisy. Vicky Filetto. Vicky's future plans consist of working at a second chance wildlife rescue graduate school and expanding her dog training business. Love for paws. Vicky's greatest accomplishment while attending college were returning to school at an older stage of her life and achieving a goal she set 22 years ago. Vicky would like to thank all the staff in FWCE department and her amazing professors. Thank you for being her guide through her journey and for sharing your expertise with a gal from the city. Congratulations, Vicky. Jamie Grijalva. Jamie's future plans include working as a head groundskeeper in professional baseball. Jamie would like to start a scholarship fund in the future so others can receive the help they need. Jamie would like to thank her family, girlfriend, friends, and NMSU faculty for all of the help and support throughout college. Congratulations. Jaime, sorry Jaime. Rosella Lovato. Rosella's future plans include working for a little, a little while and then applying to veterinary school. She hopes to attend either WSU, CSU, or OSU. Rosella's greatest accomplishments while attending college include graduating with honors, two minors, and gaining research experience under reproductive physiology, Dr. Adam Summers. Rosella would like to thank her parents for supporting her desire to enter into a field of animal science. She would also like to thank the professors who helped encourage her along the way. Congratulations, Rosella. Kaylee Gillespie. Kaylee plans on working in extension with 4-H and agriculture. While in college, her greatest accomplishments include being collegiate 4-H president, selected for National Western Roundup Collegiate, and a dog mom. Katie would like to thank her family, friends, professors, and supervisors for all the help and support through her college experience. Congratulations, Kaylee. Raheem Jarvis Van Slest. Raheem's future plans include becoming an agriculture educator and FFA advisor in eastern New Mexico. She is getting married this fall and plans to start a show calf operation with her husband. Raheem's biggest accomplishments include student teaching in the middle of pandemic and making the dean's list. Ramey is also proud of her growth as a future teacher. Ramey also served as an ACES ambassador. Ramey would like to thank Dr. Hodnett, Dr. Dormady, and Dr. Edgar for being great mentors and educators. She would also like to thank her fiance and her mom for being her greatest supporters. Congratulations. Cheyenne Garcia. Cheyenne's future plans include hoping to work in a vet clinic as a vet tech and continuing for a while as an assistant horse trainer. Cheyenne's greatest accomplishments include graduating with honors as a Crimson Scholar, being a part of Sigma Alpha Agricultural Society, and apart from the fabulous ACES College. Cheyenne would like to thank all of her family and friends for their endless support and love throughout the college journey. Congratulations, Cheyenne. Elizabeth Torrizo. Elizabeth's future plans are to pursue a Master's of Arts in Agricultural Extension and Education starting in fall of 2021. 
Elizabeth's greatest accomplishments, uh, greatest accomplishment is being a first generation college graduate in her family and being able to show her parents that hard work and sacrifice did pay off. Elizabeth would like to thank her family, especially her parents, who supported her through it all. She would also like to thank her, all the amazing new people she met throughout the past four years. Congratulations, Elizabeth. Okay. Mary Angel Varela. Mary Angel is joining the Animal Science PhD program at the University of Arizona. She will then work for the Smithsonian Conservation Institute Endocrinology Lab or perhaps turn into a potato. Maria, Maria Lina's uh, greatest accomplishment is under, uh, in undergrad was to identify her fear of failing and overcome this fear by pushing herself to try new things outside of her comfort zone. Maria Angel would like to thank her family for supporting her time in school, her boyfriend for showing her love, how to love herself, and her mentor, Dr. Boeing, for being the best role model ever. Congratulations, Maria Angel. Riley Walker. Riley's future includes a variety of potential careers from the opportunity to work on a high fence deer ranch to the opportunity to stale, sell asphalt maintenance products. Riley, Riley's greatest accomplishments include being the first in her immediate family to graduate college while holding down a part-time job working 30 hours a week. Riley would like to thank her parents, close friends and family, Dr. Campbell, Dr. Ashley, Dr. Luce, Dr. Soljigarius, and Bernadine Bookie with TRIO. Congratulations, Riley. Fausto Rogel. Fausto's future plans would be attending TCU for ranch management. Then he will go back home to help his family run their farms and ranches. He's proud of being in the Honors College and being a Crimson Scholar. He's also proud of being part of the Viticulture Program as an intern. Fausto would like to thank his parents, family and friends for their unconditional support. We make a living by what we get but we make a life by what we give. Congratulations, Fausto. Kaylee Simpson. Kaylee would, will continue her education on a fellowship in the Texas A&M Ecology and Conservation Biology PhD program. She will also continue her Texas NRCS Range Management Pathway Internship. Kaylee achieved two majors and two minors with a 4.0 GPA completing three internships, one in Ireland, served as national student conclave president, played sports, and competed on the soil judging team. Kaylee is receiving the NMSU Alumni Outstanding Senior Award. Kaylee would like to thank her mom and dad for all their love and guidance, her family and friends for their support, and Dr. And Andres Sibbles, Dr. April Ullery, and Dr. Colby Brungard for their time and mentorship. Congratulations, Kaylee. Yeah. Okay. Sydney Schumacher. Sydney's future plans include attending Washington State University's College of Veterinary Medicine in the fall of 2021, where she plans to focus on small animal and equine medicine. Sid Sydney's greatest accomplishments include raising a guide, raising a guide for the guide dogs for the blind, and getting into vet school. Sydney served as an ACES ambassador. Sydney would like to thank her family for always pushing her to do her best. She would also like to thank her friends and mentors that have helped her throughout college. Congratulations, Sydney. Haley Peck. Haley's future plans include attending vet school at Washington State University beginning in the fall. Haley's greatest accomplishments are receiving her American FFA degree. Haley would like to personally thank her mom and dad and brother for being her support system throughout her undergraduate studies. Congratulations, Haley. Take a breath. Yeah. Are you sweating? Yes, it's very warm. Christina Martinez. Christina's future plans include expanding her dog, small dog boarding business while still venturing into new career paths. She hopes to travel the world and see new places. Christina's biggest accomplishments would be that against all the odds she faced in her four years, she was able to pass all her classes without failing a single one. Christina would like to thank her mother and family for all their support throughout this journey. She is appreciative of all her incredible professors here at NMSU for their guidance and their dedication. Congratulations, Christina. Garrett Wright. 
Ethan's, Ethan's future plans will include seeking a career in farm and livestock production and working toward a lifelong goal of farm and ranch ownership. While in college, Ethan achieved a high academic standard while working in research labs and being an active member of the ACES organization. These activities opened many doors during college and beyond. Ethan served as an ACES ambassador. Ethan would like to thank all of the wonderful professors, advisors, and friends who supported him in his studies and other dealings, and especially his parents and family. Congratulations, Garrett. Regan Walker Pettis. Regan hopes to serve the children and families of her community. She plans on pursuing a graduate degree in the future. Regan feels her greatest accomplishment while attending college is showing others that it is never too late to pursue your goals. Regan wants to thank her husband, Christopher, her son, Oliver, her parents and siblings and grandmother and friends for their constant patience and support. She couldn't have done it without all of you. Congratulations, Regan. Eugenio, Eugenio Flores. Eugenio's future plans include going back to Mexico to work with his father on the ranch, to have a new house to live in with his wife and future son, and to have their own ranch. Eugenio's greatest accomplishments are speaking English because it is, it is his second language, and passing the genetics class in his second year of college. Eugenio would like to thank his professors and friends for all their help and support that they gave him. He wants to say thanks to all the professors from Animal Science that gave him a chance. Congratulations, Eugenio. Okay. Cole Busser. Cole's plan Cole plans to move to Idaho with his beautiful girlfriend and apply to dental school while she attends vet school. Cole's greatest accomplishments include being the president of the NMSU Bass Fishing Team, holding officer roles in the NMSU Pre-Dental Society, meeting faculty, staff, and lifelong friends. Cole is receiving the Outstanding Student Award. Cole would like to thank his parents, Dale and Lavina, his girlfriend, Sienna, and the rest of his family and friends. They have all shown so much support and cannot thank them enough. Sienna Moore. Sienna's future plans include traveling to Washington State to attend their DVM program and become a practicing veterinarian. Sienna's greatest accomplishments include obtaining all A's for the entirety of her college career, serving as an officer for Horsemen's Association for three straight years, and becoming a better leader. Sienna would like to thank her dad, Stacy Morrow, her mom, Cynthia Moore, her siblings, Clara, Jared, Randy, Skyler, Dylan, and Serena and her boyfriend, Cole Busser, for all of their support and love. Congratulations, Sienna. Uhala Sarar. Uhala plans to pursue a postdoc position after graduation to practice independent research, hone technical skills, and focus on her research interest. Uhala think, thinks that she walked out of college being a much more independent, mature, and confident person than when she first came to the United States. Uhala would like to thank her parents for the values they had instilled in her. Also, she's grateful to her husband for his support and academic advisor for his valuable mentorship. Congratulations, Uhala. Joseph Luhan. Joseph's future plans include pursuing a career in production agriculture. Joseph's greatest accomplishments is receiving the outstanding, outstanding, the outstanding undergraduate member of the Alpha Gamma Rho fraternity. Joseph would like to thank his family and friends for all their support throughout his time here at New Mexico State University. Congratulations, Joseph. Okay. Tiffany Sanziba. Tiffany's future plans include raising a baby girl due in June. After that, Tiffany will decide what career she wants to pursue. Tiffany's greatest accomplishments were being involved in the pre-vet club and being the pre-vet club president for a time. Tiffany would like to thank her husband, Clay, and her parents, Lori and Jerry, for supporting and encouraging her throughout her schooling. Congratulations, Tiffany. Angelica Hernandez. Angelica's future plans are to pursue teaching in an elementary setting. Angelica's greatest accomplishments include working with the grads, 
Child Development Center and gaining amazing experience. First and foremost, Angelica would like to thank God. She also thanks her family for all their love, support, and their motivation. Congratulations, Angelica. Theodore Muka. Theodore's plans include starting medical school at UNM this July and becoming a practicing physician in the future. Theodore's greatest accomplishments include winning presentation awards at the UNM UPN Poster Symposium and the annual biomedical research conference for minority students. Theodore would like to thank Dr. Christopher Kramer for being an excellent professor and academic advisor. Theodore would also like to thank Dr. Ian Ray for his support inside and outside of the class. Congratulations, Theodore. Ashraf Saeed. Ashraf's future plan is to continue working on research as a faculty member at Omar al University in Libya. Ashraf's greatest accomplishment was to network and begin friendships with the great scientists at NMSU. Ashraf would like to thank his academic advisor, Dr. Hatim Jelly, for guidance during his research. Ashraf would also like to thank his wife, children, and friends for all the support and encouragement. Congratulations, Ashraf. Bailey Payne, complete with a cat. What's the cat's name? Brady? Brady. So Bailey has Brady, and she's thankful for all the support for her friends and family. Congratulations, Brady. Annalisa Miller. Annalisa will be attending the University of New Mexico School of Law in the fall with hopes of becoming a lawyer in the agricultural field. Annalisa's greatest accomplishments include being selected as the outstanding Ax Ed student, qualifying for the Dean's List each semester and completing, competing in the National NAMA competition. Annalisa served as an ACES ambassador. Annalisa would like to thank her friends, family, and professors for her support throughout their college and always offering a helping hand. Congratulations, Annalisa. Ellen Bossman. Ellen plans to work part-time as a marriage and family therapist. She looks forward to working with doctors Montanez and Valancourt as well as some former classmates. Ellen's greatest accomplishment while working full-time while achieving her second master's degree and facing, how are you? <laughs> and facing down her math phobia by surviving statistic classes. Ellen would like to thank mom, Jim, Jay, Mary, Cheryl, Celia, Carrie, Lisa, Norris, and everyone at the NMSU Library Technical Services Department, Dr. Titus and Dr. Maureen Montanez and Dr. Valancourt. Congratulations, Ellen. I know that lady. <laughs> Lorena Cassiano. Lorena's future plans include applying to neuroscience PhD program in the fall. She will be attending graduate school in fall 2022, where she will continue to conduct research in the neuro field. Lorena's greatest accomplishments include being an active member of the Pieta Sigma, Alpha, Xi, Delta, STEM H, and building research achievement in neuroscience program, and the cat's meow. Lorena would like to thank her family, friends, NMSU, and the program she has been a part of for supporting her financially, physically, and mentally. Congratulations, Lorena. April Paredes. Hi, April. April's future plans are unknown, but they will not be boring. April's greatest accomplishments are graduating as an Aggie and being involved with the community. April would like to thank her family and friends for giving her daily love and support. She would also like to thank the animal science faculty for giving her such an amazing opportunity to learn and grow. Congratulations, April. 
Brianna Rower. Brianna's future plans are going to be declared by the Lord. Stated in Jeremiah 29 11, the Lord declares plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. Brianna's greatest accomplishments include experiencing the college life and graduating during this t pandemic. Brianna would like to thank Dr. Marisa Fowler and the CAASS advisor, Dr. Clint Lust, her friends Rosella Lovato, Taylor Edwinson, and April Paredes, her husband Cody Lewis, and of course, her parents. Congratulations, Brianna. Rebecca McCarty. Rebecca's plan plans to stay at NMSU to complete her master's degree in agricultural communications. She will also be starting a career as a learning designer for Viac, Viviac in June. Looking back, Rebecca sees her greatest accomplishments as putting in her best effort each and every day while helping others do the same. Rebecca served as an ACES ambassador. Rebecca is receiving the Dean's Award of Excellence, Leadership Excellence. Re Rebecca would like to thank her friends and family for their endless support in school and in her life. She would also like to thank her professors for investing their time and energy in their students. Congratulations, Rebecca. Karina Arvizu Acosta. Karina's future plans include joining Pop Papa's Restaurant in their entry-level management training program. Karina's greatest accomplishments include being a recipient of the National Restaurant Association Scholarship for two years in a row. In addition, serving as the Community Service Chair for N. S M H. Karina is receiving the Dean's Award of Excellence. Karina would like to thank the HRTM department for guiding her and for the unconditional support she has received throughout her college journey. She would also like to thank her family and friends. Congratulations, Karina. Caitlin Mason. Caitlin's future plans are to continue her education and get a master's degree. Caitlin's greatest accomplishment in college was gaining confidence to do things even if she has never done them before in the lab, in school, and in life. Caitlin would like to thank her parents, Clay and Stacy Mason, her siblings, Sandra and Clay, and the rest of her family and friends for their love and support. To Dr. Randall, Dr. Kramer, and also to Dr. Ray, thank you. Congratulations, Caitlin. Andrick Johnson. Andre's future plan is unknown at the moment. Andre's greatest, greatest accomplishment is graduating from college. Andre would like to thank his family members, NMSU rodeo coach, and friends for their support throughout college. Congratulations, Andre. No, <laughs> trying to get out of Cheyenne, here. They're both in that car. Yeah, they're both Cheyenne Poyer. Cheyenne's future plans include obtaining an internship in equine reproduction. One of Cheyenne's greatest accomplishments includes maintaining a Crimson Scholar status while obtaining her bachelor's degree. Cheyenne would like to thank her family and friends for their encouragement and support during her journey at NMSU. Congratulations, Cheyenne. Grant Stoner, Grant's future plans include working with the NRCS. Grant's greatest accomplishment was being a Crimson Scholar. Grant would like to thank the ACES faculty. Congratulations, Grant. Chandakar Islam. If Dicker's plans include plans include continuing his research work along the certain outreach service besides an educator. He is a prestigious NMWRI student research grant winner. He received a 
recognized arts and science general scholarship three years in a row due to his consistent academic excellence. He is receiving the Dean's Award of Excellence as a graduate. He would like to express his thankful appreciation and gratitude to his parents, his wife, Faryana, Jasmine, and his advisor, Dr. Brown, for their support and inspiration throughout his doctoral research studies. Congratulations, God Doctor. Okay. Michaela Santa. Michaela's plans after graduation is to move to Jacksonville, Florida to start her career with the Frito-Lay Pepsi Company. Michaela's greatest accomplishment was being accepted into the Disney College program. Michaela would like to thank her family and friends who stood by her throughout the past four years. Also in that car is Savannah Willingham. Savannah's plans to continue to work on film sets while also working on social media marketing on the side. Savannah's greatest accomplishments in college are maintaining a 4.0 GPA and graduating with honors. Savannah is receiving the Academic Achievement Award. Savannah would like to thank her friends, family, and professors for supporting her and giving her amazing opportunities to grow. Congratulations, Savannah. Noah Cully. Noah's future plans are to start his own small business, most likely in farming or real estate, possibly both. One of Noah's greatest accomplishments is making it to second place with the NAMA team. Noah would like to thank Chatty for guiding him through his, this stressful journey that we call college. Congratulations, Noah. I can start with that one. Luis Lujan Zavala. Luis plans to earn multiple veterinary experiences after graduating to support his goal of assisting in veterinary school. While in college, Luis had the opportunity to participate in multiple research programs and present a poster for the WSASAS. He also served as a counsel officer and assisted equine therapies. Luis would like to especially thank Dr. Ivy, Dr. Campbell, Dr. Eric, and Dr. Summers. Additionally, thank you to the grad students that taught him new things and allowed him to help them with their projects. Congratulations, Luis. Sierra Sonner. Sierra's plans include finding community-based employment to help individuals better themselves and the community. Sierra's greatest accomplishments include being a Crimson Scholar and being on the Dean's List. Sierra would also includes being able to study abroad as one of the greatest academic accomplishments. Sierra would like to thank her fiance and her stepson for motivating her every day to keep pursuing her goals. Ciara would like to thank her parents and her family for their encouragement. Congratulations, Ciara. Sue Garul. Sarah. Sorry, Garul. Sorry, Sarah. Sarah's future plans will be attending Texas A&M in the fall to pursue a master's degree in physiology of repro reproduction. Sarah's greatest accomplishments include serving as an ACES ambassador, ACES mentor, and publishing a peer-reviewed journal article while being an undergraduate student. Sarah is receiving the Dean's Award of Excellence. Sarah would like to thank the animal science faculty and graduate students, especially Dr. Jennifer Hernandez Gifford, for all of their mentorship and support. Congratulations, Sarah. Luis Ramos Coronado. Congratulations, Luis. I'm sure you want to thank your family and friends for all their support. Good work. Congratulations, Luis Ramos. You made it. Joseph Aragon. Joseph plans after graduation include moving to Spain to work as an auxiliary de conservación assisting in the classroom helping the youth of Spain learn English. 
Joseph's greatest accomplishment while attending college would be the fact that he is graduating with honors. Congratulations, Joseph. Joseph would like to thank his family for their endless support. He wouldn't have been able to do it without them. He would also like to thank all of the friends he made along this journey. Congratulations, Joseph. You can have them. Okay. My name is Don Connor. I'm Associate Dean for the uh, College of ACES. Uh, this is something new for us, and I want to thank everyone for being part of this college tradition, even though it's a little different this year. Uh, to the graduates, you were graduate this weekend as members of the Sam Steele Society, which, which is committed to professional honor, honest enterprise, and the welfare of all people. The faculty of the college are delighted to have you as members. Congratulations. Be bold. Go save, shape the future, graduates. Go Aggies. Thank you again.